<laughs> Welcome. I'm a bit of a sweaty mess because I don't have the air conditioning running in here and I have big studio lights in front of me. So, um, yeah, <laughs> I'm out of breath. So this video is really not, not, uh, not polished, but Hey, it, it's real and it's raw. So, um, I recently bought two different snares. I have a, uh, uh, Ludwig 13 by three. I'm not sure if it's the old maple or if it's the poplar version, but I have it here with the, uh, the Evans HD dry head on it, which is probably a little too dry, but, um, I bought it for the pork pie and decided I didn't like it on the pork pie. I just thought I would play some different tunings and, uh, throw some different muting techniques on the snare. Let me take off. This is the drum taco. Um, take that off for now. So let's, uh, let's get in here. The tuning on this right now, I would say it's mid medium. So let me play a little bit. All right, um, I did not really plan this out, so uh, we're just gonna wing it. I'm gonna tighten this up a bit. I really only had one side of it loosened, but let's see. Right, let me crank it up a bit more and then we'll play around some muffling. So you can see, pretty high. Yeah. It chokes itself a bit when you get it up that high. So let's see how it sounds with the uh, the drum taco. It's got a magnet on it and some probably buckshot inside of it. You can see it kills it completely. I keep hitting my mic. Thankfully, I can mute this when I'm playing. I try not to hit it, so my hi-hat works a bit messy. All right, so uh, that's the drum taco. Now I've got, trying not to talk away from the mic because it's pretty directional. All right. I think this is everything. I have a bunch of um, big fat snare drum, but I cut one of them up. So one of them is just the ring. Well, let's see. That pretty much kills it too. And then, this is half without the weight. Not too bad, it's a little lower. And then, 
half with the weight. Pretty similar. Excuse me. And then the whole thing. So if you want, <laughs> if you crank your snare up and want kind of a beefy sound, but you still want it high pitched, um, you certainly can get that. Now, I'm gonna tune, oh, I also have just a cut snare drum head. You can see how different that is. All right, so now I'm just gonna lower the lugs closest to me. Tune a little of the I'm gonna tune a little bit of the rest of it down. Now let's see what it sounds like with the uh, big fat snare. <laughs> yeah, it drops it a lot. I'm gonna move this. There you go. You can see it's pretty pretty beefy but the snare is still tuned pretty high so let's throw the, uh, the drum taco on there again and I'm gonna put it off the side a little bit more there we go Try this one since I know it really deadens it. I'm going to crank it way up. That's got a crack. Now let's try the taco. Let's see how the, the big one sounds. Let's try this. It's like a firecracker. It's probably similar to the thing on.
Yeah, I've got it cranked up. Almost to the uh, piccolo. It's got a nice bite when it's that cranked, though. Now, I'm going to crank it up a little bit more and loosen the other side because I'm pretty sure I can get the lower sound with a, uh, it still has a decent bite to it. Now, put a little bit of the taco on. That's not bad. Still pretty sensitive. It's got a nice crack to it, but it's not too high and pingy. And then with the extra drum taco. Now the other snare, it's really dry because of the Evans. HD dry head. And I've got it cranked up. So let me, I'm gonna tune this down and see how it sounds. Since it's a 13 also, throw this on there. This really kills the overtones. It's not bad. Let's see if I can play this open-handed. I do wish I had a different head on here to show you, but I don't really want to swap heads right now. Now I'm curious. <laughs> Get a little beef out of a three inch. I really do love this snare. I'm still getting used to the sounds you can get out of it, but um, hope you enjoyed this. Hope it helped somebody. Um, if you got any tips, especially for these pork pies, a uh, head that you like or a tuning you like on it, uh, post it in the comments because I'm always up for learning more stuff. Thanks for watching and I hope you subscribe.